Hello everybody! Today I'll show you how to set up KCD Tweaks Royal Edition. First up, click on the link below to get to Nexus Mods. Click on Files and download the latest version. I already did so and put it in an empty folder. I highly recommend to do so because at the first start the program will create a few config files. Here on the right you see my Kingdom Deliverance folder without any mods installed. Let's start KCD Tweaks. So you recognize this is the first start and creates the setting files and ask me where the game is installed. I have the GOG version by the way. But okay. So he creates the mods folder and the KCD Tweaks folder. He asks us where you can find 7-zip. This is needed to extract and later inject the files we've edited. It's okay. And here we are. The extracted files are in this folder, XML files. Now we see he has recognized the correct path to the game and to 7-zip. All folders are present. Now we can change a few things around. And because Kingdom Come Deliverance is based on the CryEngine, we can even set a few hardware tweaks. Let's say we want to utilize 6 cores, 16 GB of RAM, 11 GB of VRAM, improved texture streaming. Yeah, looks good. So we can apply those values. Those are now written into these XML files. And if we said activate mod, he will create the data folder and the actual mod. So let's start the game and see if it had worked. And it doesn't matter how strong your rig is, this game takes ages to start. No, let's skip that. We love loading screens. Because we love loading screens so much, we directly take the next. Yay, loading screen. So, we are in game. Let's take out the bow. The reticle is still there, so this trick works. And if we take a look in the inventory, we have carry weight plus 500, so that worked too. Nice! So, Kingdom Come Deliverance Tweaks, Royal Edition. Works. Have fun. <laughs>